Hey y'all, cooking, cutting up, keeping it real. Listen, in my kitchen tonight, I have kind of bribed my friend to help me do these peach fr fritters. Tracy Christmas is one of my dearest friends, and she is a peach lover. Every time we go out, whatever there is peach on the menu, you're the peach girl. So, what better thing to make this time of year? So, I put up peaches this morning. I've got two cups measured out for this. I've never done this. So, it's going to be a learning experience for both of us. So, we both like peaches, but you like them uh, like better than anybody I know. Yep. So, and the, peach, and the peach fritters, I posted a picture of the recipe. So, we're going to get started with ours here. And, Tracy, I'm going to let you just go with it, girl. Oh, I'm going to be your sous chef. Honey. I am. You want to put it's one? It's a recipe you've never done before. You, you can do it. Well, listen, we're going to do it. We're going to wing it like we do everything else. You're going to do one cup of all-purpose flour. It said put all your dry ingredients together first. Okay. And you. then I'll just kind of hand you everything. Because the people, they like to see different people on here. And Tracy's like super fun and all that. And <laughs> you never know what me and her might get into. It's, it could be a fiasco. We're going to do have three. I remember that that's going because. I know, I know. I know. <laughs> kind of get carried away. <laughs> they like carried away. Oh, though. well. Yeah. Three tablespoons of, a, a, I about said all purpose sugar. Of sugar. <laughs> of granulated well, white I mean, sugar. That wouldn't be wrong. Yeah, it wouldn't be wrong. Three. So we're going to do three of those. Okay, I got you. And I've got our oil uh, up to temperature on the stove here. Matter of fact, I'm going to. All right, boost it just a little bit. What do I got? Three down. All right, you got three of those, and then you're going to put in one fourth teaspoon of salt, which is right here in the salt and box. And now I'm blind. So That's I'm all right. All right. There you go. You can't ruin it. You got the pink stuff in there too, don't you? Yeah, I got pink Himalayan salt in there too. And then Drew came home, brought all his spices from his house, so mm -hmm. now I have white salt in there too. I bought, I bought some pink stuff, but I haven't used it yet. Yeah, they say it's healthier. I don't know. It tastes just as good. But okay. anyway, okay. Now we're going to do the salt. Now you're going to do a half a teaspoon of cinnamon. Which didn't I get that out when all those spices uh, I don't fell think out? You ever, I don't think you ever. All the spices it. fell out. Where's your bacon powder? Oh, right here. Because I've got a bacon powder's it. right there. And I thought I got the cinnamon out. That's here. Okay. This is the keeping it real part, Tracy. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Well, the deal's falling out. You know what? I'm losing my deal. Life is real. It is. It, we keep it real around here for sure. So we're going to put the bacon. But I thought I did set the nutmeg. So in. we're going to put the uh -huh. there's put nutmeg that, down here. Yep. Put that in there. So one and a half. Yep. So there's one and a half. And here is your Girl, um, you cinnamon. Know, I, you're ready. You realize I am not a kitchen person. Yeah, right? but you're going to be a kitchen person. Well. You're a kitchen person. No, I'm, I'm a Lisa person. You are. I'll cook hey. for you. That's no problem. <laughs> no problem at all. Right, Here's so your cinnamon. You're going to do a half teaspoon of that. Okay, I can do that. And then one eighth teaspoon of uh, nutmeg, which I do half of that half because I don't even think I have an eighth teaspoon on there. I just do half of that. Half of half? Mm-hmm. I put a little bit of nutmeg on my peach pie earlier. It's, it's good. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Good. All right. So there we have that. All of our dry ingredients. It says just give it a whirl. So give it a whirl there, Tracy. I know. See? You're natural. <laughs> We're going to add our um, liquid mixture to this, which okay. is one third cup of milk, which I've already met, measured out. And I put my our egg in here. And I put our vanilla you, in here. Uh, here's a question I want to ask. Yes. So I know sometimes they'll do like the milk and the egg. Do yes. You, do you do the egg in it or just not drop, always? Just drop it and go. No, I, I, like, most of the time I just drop it like it's hot. <laughs> <laughs> well, it is the Fourth of July in North it Carolina, is. and it is ninety some odd degrees. So it it's is. Hot. It is. So we just dropped it and it's we, hot. We're we dropping it. it. It's hot. We're just waiting for the <laughs> rain to hit. Hopefully, crazy. So when it, when that gets incorporated, then what we're gonna do? I'm gonna grab an ice cream scoop and we'll use Can the I ice cream scoop to put it into the um, grease. You know it's gotta be good. We're gonna deep fry. Heaven sakes. Well, of course. For sure. I mean, now, everything's soup, better right? deep fried. Right. Oreos. Anything. We like cheese. it all. Cheesecake. All right, is this combined enough? That looks really good. All right. All right, now I'm going to bring the camera off of the tripod over here. And what we're going, what okay. you're going to do is scoop and put it here. And just be careful when you drop it in because this grease is hot. And you know what? It might even be a better idea to put a, put a couple of them in here and then and set them down. down. Mm -hmm. okay. And then it won't pop everywhere, hopefully. Okay. So I'm going to hand you the gavel. Oh. And I'm going to grab the camera, and really this is a better way to film because you can see close up. Okay, guys, so I'm going to show uh, our stove situation here. I'm going to flip this camera oh, a, whole, a whole one? Yep, I would do a whole one, and we'll just do like, like little ones. Like yeah. this? Yeah, okay. perfect. All right, here we go. If that'll drop, it won't drop. There, there you go. go. 
There Ooh. we go. Ooh, that's, oh, oh, wait. You know what? what? Pull it back up. We forgot to put the daggone uh, peaches in it. Lord Jesus. I wonder what we were doing. Pull it back up. It, it won't hurt it. For, bring it back over here. We're going to incorporate it. Y'all, we forgot the peaches. Hey, pal. Uh -oh. <laughs> that was my fault. I'm just talking. Well, visiting. So there's the peaches. Hey, look. Well, here's a fritter. <laughs> hey, I know. Put that fritter back in there. We're going to mix that sucker back in there. Right, and then go ahead and mix again. Sorry, Tracy. That was my fault. Oh, it's okay. I know. Yeah. Opa's like, ha ha. Opa, that sounds like something that I would do, doesn't it? So we're just going to kind of crush those. I was wondering if it was while we were already throwing them in the... Yeah, I, okay. I, 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 we I were was trusting we were make, you. We were going to make plain fritters. I was trusting you. That's what we were trying. We were making plain donuts. <laughs> We were making well, hey, fun of balls. Pop those suckers out. Throw some bread, <laughs> throw some uh, powdered sugar and cinnamon right. on them. We would have been we good never to go. the difference. All right. All so right. We're gonna now we're going to start that over again. Are you sure this little scoop is going to be enough to grab these peaches? I think so. I mean, it, well, you like can smush them down, kind of. All right, let me do I that. I didn't dice them. I just sliced them. That's and, what I'm thinking. Maybe we should just... Yeah, just... Put, so we get actually, it probably would be a better idea because then you'll get peaches in every bite. We, and we like that. Yeah, we want Tracy, your nails look so pretty for the camera and everything. See? I mean, seriously. I don't know. Who wants to watch fireworks when you can watch how to make peach fritters? It was not planned. Trust me on that Heaven's one. Heaven's sakes. Here. All right, we think we're in a good I shape? I think that's good. All mm -hmm. right, we're going to go with this. Yep, let's go with it. We're going to make this work. We're going to drop those in. We're and gonna, then once we're we... We're going to edit that other part out. So <laughs> <laughs> well, listen, when we send it to Food Network, we will because this one is live. <laughs> okay. Let's try it again. We had a good rhythm going there. All right, I know. It popped out of the little thing it really did. good. All right, so we're going to do this. Yep. They're a little wet. Yep. So we're going to drop them in real quick. Mm-hmm. Get it'll get loose from the... There oh, you go. There we go. It's cool. like little hush puppies. Well, look at that. Okay. I know. Isn't that fancy? Well, they're still a little wet. I'm that's all right. Well, that's from the juice from the uh, peaches. Yeah. They ain't going to be wet long because they're going to be deep fried. Ooh, they look good. Mm-hmm. Oh, my. Right, mm -hmm. Turn this in real quick because they're like quick and quick. Yeah. Oh, they are quick. Let me yeah. turn the seat down just a tad. All right, let's see if we can get this one flipped. Okay. There we go. And then flip the other one. Okay. All right, because see that, how quick that did that? Let me see. Look how quick that did that. Dang right, it did. Here, pull that sucker out. I'll put it right here. Yeah. I'm going to flip that one more time. There we it's go. It's quicker Ooh. than we thought. Oh, it smells fabulous. It does smell fabulous. Y'all are firecrackers up in the kitchen. And we are doors. We're firecrackers <laughs> no matter where we go. We're All right, up. let's keep going there, Trace. And then we'll, we'll we mix up work. that honey topping. I'm just wondering, could, could you think I can drop this in there without killing myself? I think so. I'll just be careful. Ooh, that's See there? much better. There that's go. much better. I can do that. I can do that. I'm going to try to get... There you go. All right, here we I go. I got a good view here now. Then we can get them in here a little bit faster. Mine and Tracy's sons played baseball together, and... We got in quite a lot of <laughs> trouble in the stands. And people want to say, are y'all good or bad girls? And, and I only have one thing to say to that. It depends. It depends. It does depend on how long the tournament is and how hot it is. And, and how hot it is. And, yes. And if you've been with friends. And That's right. Need to change. That's right. It just is what it is. You just, the CVS has to depend. Yeah, and always. Lot, and there's a lot of mamas out there that actually going to understand <laughs> They will understand it. If they knew the whole story, it was quite funny, I have to say. It is. Oh, my gosh. These are so, this is so cool. See, I'm, I, and I have to be honest Is there you. more done over there? Yeah, I think so. All right, you want me to hand you the tray? Yeah, it's more you. fun cooking with somebody else, ain't it? Well, but I'll tell you this much, and I'm gonna, I'll have to confess of my, my kitchen prowess. I hate grease. It scares me. I don't like cooking with grease. But this is a lot deeper, and it's a lot better than what I have. So yeah. I think it's the size of the pot yeah hey, hey. <laughs> it ain't the amount of grease it's the size of the pot so, you don't feel quite so like it's going to splash out on you right yeah i so got this you this is not so bad i can do this i'm trying to get it make sure that it stays all right so it gets on all sides god they smell good they do smell good i'm trying not to get it on you either you're fine I actually have always had a terrible fear of like dropping a pot of grease. Oh, oh. I won't even oh. touch, I won't even pick it up and transfer it to another location. I'm so terrified of yes, it. Yes, I get that. Now that I can understand. Sherry, they do look like hush puppies, but they're actually peach fritters. But now, Tracy, now that we know how to do this, we could do our own hush puppies too, for sure. Oh, that's, that's oh, for sure. I know, right? I love hush That'd puppies. That'd be another honey recipe. Too. I sat and watched um, one of uh, the cousins. They made up their dough and they sat on a 
set by the deep fryer uh -huh. on a um, cutting board. And they had it roll, they had it laid out in this, it was thick enough to where the, the dough was just in a, like a little, uh -huh. and they would just cut and drop and cut and drop and cut Yum. and drop. They would just come up and it Sounds worked. Sounds good to me. And it worked. It worked. Spencer, we're getting ready to put some chicken wings on the, on the Barbie, on the Blackstone in just a few minutes. We gotta finish our, our fritters. Tracy is quite the Betty Crocker up in here. <laughs> open her, open her. We need some music. You know what? These you can't play music because if it ain't your own, they they take your oh. video down. Oh, I don't understand Good that, point. but they do. Good point. I guess there are some copyright laws. We want to do it by the book. That's right. I don't want to go to the. We, I don't want to go to Facebook Popo Land. No. No. I mean, honey. I mean, I've always said. Brenda, that. I've never had peach fritters either, but I think they're going to be amazing. I love apple fritters, and because I had all these peaches, and I knew Tracy was coming, and she loves peaches. I was like, let's do some peach fritters. Yes. So we're doing it. It might be like this new discovery of this great dessert. Cool. I guess you could use the same could, recipe I bet though. You could set powdered sugar on those suckers right well, now. Well, I think you could do the same recipe and not add any fruit, and it just be like a donut. Yeah, pretty yeah. much. I mean, that's like a final pack. Yeah, pretty much. There we go. Tracy, I think you've been holding out on me on your kitchen skills, girly. <laughs> uh, she has been. She has been. She's been holding the rook. Mm -hmm. <laughs> she sure has. She's been well, sandbagging. You know, you got to have some little few secrets here and there. Well, I guess you're right. But, you know. I just don't have that many. Everybody knows mine. Well. Depends. Depends. depends on, it all depends. It all depends on who <laughs> walks up. And how many fields you've been to in one day in July. Mm -hmm. And sweating like a babang. Yes. <laughs> and your backside feels like a babang. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Till you go to the CVS okay. and get your son to pants. Mm -hmm. Oh, and here we go. Mm -hmm. And the story is out. Yeah, yep. See, there you're saying. Ain't no out. shame in my game about that now. I was fresh as a daisy by the time we got to the <laughs> wet floor still. And the, the umpires all thought we had been partaken. <laughs> they thought we, we had were, not. They thought we were tore up from they, the floor. But up. we were not. But that's just our natural personality. That was funny. And the boys didn't really know what we were laughing at, but they were like, uh, oh my gosh. No, they were going, we don't know them. We don't know them. I have no idea. They wandered up off the street, and that's what Listen, happened. we have to embarrass them when we can. Sorry, that's our All job. right, I'm going to toss that. Okay. And we're going to finish that up. And then we're going to make the glaze that goes over them. Ooh, there's a glaze. Yep. It has honey and um, milk. And I don't remember what else. I'll have to look the recipe. You see, you had me at honey. <laughs> I know, right? You could just pour honey over them and I'll be I ready. know. And y'all, tomorrow I'm going to be doing some live honey bee. And I don't really know what you call it when you pull the trays out of the honey bee thing. But I'm doing it tomorrow with Linda Grace, and I'm excited about it. I invited Tracy to come along. She said, I don't have to mess with the bees, do I? I said, no, but you can video. She but said, oh, okay. We're going to see how that works. All right. How did you find the recipes? Um, Lisa, uh, Lisa, I looked in Pinterest and I literally just go, uh, searched uh, peach recipes and picked one out. And there was a peach cobbler muffin in there. Oh, Ooh, that sounds bad. Yes. I had one of those peach muffins at Biscuitville about two weeks ago. Holy smokes, they're good. All right. I mean, really good. Try not to get it on you. You're good. All right. You want to cut the, cut the heat on uh -huh. this? Uh-huh. I'll or? cut it off as soon as you drop that last one. All right, I got one more. All right. And we'll mix up this icing real quick because you pour the icing over. I'm going to put y'all back up on the holster here. Just turn it off. Is that right? Uh, no. There we go. No, now it is. Way. All right, I'm going to bring you back around here, guys. And we're going to make the icing. We're going to make the icing in, in this. Okay, Just gotcha. toss that to the side because we're letting our, our wings thaw out right there. Okay, so we're going to put one cup. Too tall for this. I know, look at our lemons. I know, I know. They do look pretty. But I, they never can see my face, and it's just. We're going to get you some kind of wider. Listen, screen. I had this shorter guy in here the other day that was I, the cut cut guy. I saw he him. fit real just I perfect. I know. Actually, he squatted too, but it's okay. He was so, uh, he was so nice. Okay, we're going to do one cup of powdered sugar. So let me give you that. And do we still have a cup measure around? Or did we toss it in the oh, sink? Yeah, it's right there, I think. Okay. Oh, here's a half a cup, Tracy. Do two of these. We're going to do uh, one cup of powdered sugar in our little mixing bowl. Okay, so there's your one. 
And I'm not an exactor. -er. No, me either. And then we're going to do three tablespoons of honey. And this is the honey that Linda Grace gave me. This oh. is the kind of honey we'll be pulling tomorrow. I wouldn't even use that. We'll just dub oh, that. Just yeah, we're just going to one, two. And a three he. Three he. And if you'll grab a whisk out of that um, drawer behind you, please, ma'am, underneath the stove. And then we're going to add a half a teaspoon of cinnamon, which we're going to dub dub that, that too. Mm -hmm. And three tablespoons of milk. So if you want to give that a whisk, I'll add your milk in. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do one, two, three, okay. Here we go. Let's see how it looks. And then we're just going to, since we've got it on the rack anyway, we'll pour it over. We'll pull this to the side and then we'll so get on to the grill. We're going to just do hot dogs and wines. And wines. Cause it's the 4th of July. And I'm dirty, so. Ooh, let's taste that. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Is that good? Mm-hmm. Very good. All right, so what do you Girl, Krispy Kreme ain't got yeah. nothing on us today, okay? Do we need to spread these out a little bit? Yeah, we'll spread them out, and I just drizzle it, pour, pour it over it. All right, well, here we go. Here, here we goes. go. Here goes, fellas. They smell great. All right, so let's And have some dessert. All right, so we're just going to kind of talk to I would just them. try, I'll just try, drizzle it all over them. Mm -hmm. Let me get you a spatula. Because we want to use all that sugar. We sure do. We like some sugar around here. It's hot and mm -hmm. it's just kind of doing its thing. Don't you feel like the Krispy Kreme people a little bit? Well, I kind of do. Hot, I kind of do too. Hot, hot dogs, fritters now. Hot fritters now. <laughs> For sure. Uh -oh. I, I would drench them. All right. Let's just drench Let's go them. back to the original. There we go. I was just trying to make, not make them make, soggy. Yeah, and make sure they were going to all have enough. Oh my gosh, that's going to be good. Y'all, we might do a taste test for you. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Look at that. Hey, hey. Spot on. Fritter mama. I'm really upset with all that that's in the bottom, though. I know. But do you think we could, you know what? We'll let them cool a little bit, and then we'll roll them in. <laughs> <laughs> we don't want to waste none of that. So y'all, apple fritter, not apple fritters, peach, peach fritters, fritters with Tracy. And, and there goes the phone. They're used to it. Just press cancel. Yep. We're there going. Goes. <laughs> peach fritters with Tracy and up uh, cookie cut. Now keep it real. We'll let you know how these taste, but they look pretty and they smell wonderful. All right, Tracy. Thanks for helping me out. Thanks guys. All right. See y'all. Just fi finish.